This tutorial shows how to use the Orchestrator Studio to create a data request. A data request enables an orchestration to return data directly from a table or business view in Enterprise One. In this tutorial, we'll show an example of creating a data request to retrieve the credit limit of a customer in Enterprise One. A data request is a type of service request, so from the Orchestrator Studio homepage, let's access the Service Request page. From this page, we'll select Create Service Request to create a new data request. Here on the Data Request Design page, first, we need to give the data request a name and description and pick a product code to associate with it. You can find a customer's credit limit in the Customer Master Program, which uses a business view to access data. So in the grid area, we'll enter the business view for Customer Master to load the data items or fields for this program. If you don't know the business view or table that a program uses, you can use the Enterprise One cross-reference program to find it. Next, we need to set up filtering criteria to identify the fields that contain the data we want returned. In the Fields grid, in the Address Number row, we'll click the filter icon. The Studio adds a filter for Address Number to identify the customer for whom we want to retrieve the credit limit amount. The syntax denotes its use as a variable for passing the customer's address number to Enterprise One. We can change the filtering criteria if needed, but in this case, the default criteria is appropriate. Next, we need to specify the fields that contain the data that we want returned by this data request. In the Fields grid, we'll locate the credit limit and alpha name fields, and then click the Return icon next to each field to add them to the Return Fields and Variable Names area. We need to enter variables for each return field, so that when this data request is added to an orchestration, these variable names appear as additional orchestration inputs. This gives you the option to map the values returned from these fields to another step in an orchestration. Lastly, let's save the data request. That's it! We've successfully created a data request that when configured with an orchestration will return a customer's name and credit limit. To learn more about the features shown here and other data request features, see the Orchestrator Guide and visit us online at learnjde.com.